Every year, Miami-Dade College hosts its annual book fair here in downtown Miami, where readers, families, and writers alike can come enjoy what they love most. It takes me out of my, my world, my life, and into somebody else's. Reading is the key to knowledge. I would say it's the foundation of our democracy. Uh, these books are just something that just capture true, uh, true meaning and empathy and just knowledge and for, have for hundreds of years. The ability to, to escape your regular world, but the ability to interact, uh, to understand and to get a different perspective. Recording our own experiences is something that's really, really important and something that we're slowly losing. In literature for me, I've been reading since I was like a kid, so it's always been like a very vital, important thing for me in my life. Among these participants are a plethora of adored authors promoting and discussing their works. I am the author of Lala, a different kind of lizard, and uh, Disney reached out to me because uh, right now they're about to release a movie, and it's based, it's inspired in my country, Colombia, and, and to me, just I, I just can't be more proud that they thought that I could be a good fit uh, to write the first bilingual book inspired in the movie. We want to preserve Spanish language uh, at every cost. It's important to keep our traditions alive. I am a self-published author. It's my first book. I did it by myself, basically, after my father passed away. First in Spanish because my father wrote his manuscript in Spanish language and uh, I wanted his voice to be heard in his native language and English because I live in a bilingual world. It shows that everybody can have their own fairy tale. I mean, this is mine. I'm, I'm, I'm doing something that I love and I can't believe it. It is for me a way to honor my father. His book, his story is here. It's right here. Over 450 authors participate during the Festival of the Authors on Friday, which kicks off into the weekend with 250 authors, book exhibitions, and several partners in booths promoting themselves. Though it was launched by Miami-Dade College in 1984, it has grown into something much bigger and is now recognized as one of the nation's best literary festivals. Me and my mom, we come every year. I like it. It's nice. It's a like, very lively setting, and there's lots of different things to do. I feel like most of the other book fairs I've been to have been really small. Uh, I feel like it's very rare that I like am around this many people that are here for like books. I actually am dyslexic, so reading is a difficult thing for me, but I always like to power through and you know, just kind of overcoming any challenge that you might have just makes reading even better. It gives me the opportunity to just be exposed to you know, various different uh, types of writing from all over the world. It's always nice and you always know that you have something that you'll be able to connect with somebody else when you're here. With several streets full of things to do, see, and of course books to buy, the Miami Book Fair offers a weekend of fun for the whole family. I'm Vianne Sagello reporting for FBN News.